Okay, guys, I know you love going to real estate events with me, so let's go see this expo presentations today. Let's go. I love their events because it's well organized, parking is amazing, they do great presentations. So let's go take a look and enjoy the evening. What did you get? Yes. Chicken sandwich and fries. Let's go scale, yeah. Just the beginning of the That's the new building and that's the whole master plan. This is the new building we're talking about launching today. This is the view, the dome. Let's go. Okay, let's go to the main presentation. The new Expo City Dubai Master Plan is driving the future of Dubai. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. It's a pleasure to be here in front of all of you today, especially a lot of familiar faces that I love working with. History is such a huge part of this beautiful city, right? We're the only city in the whole world that has been a host to both a global expo and a COP28. COP28 being the largest climate sustainability conference in the world. That's right. Absolutely amazing. And we're going to continue to do these large scale country events right here. What better place than right here? Over 24 million people came through our doors during a period of six months. That's more than 200,000 people on average. Some days even over 300,000 and yet zero traffic. Why is that important? Traffic is the biggest weakness all the master communities are currently facing. And we future-proof the city against traffic. How do we do that? We did it through three unique ways. Number one, there's three main roads that come to Expo. Every single one of these three roads has 14 lanes, seven on each side. That's not all. We also have the metro that comes conveniently at our doorstep for maximum connectivity and ease of use. That's not all. The whole city, right? There's two levels to it. All underground, beautiful. The infrastructure is phenomenal, not only around the city, in the city, but also underneath. All the residences and all the commercial offices, currently they have, you just go up the elevator or escalator, which makes it an ease of use to get in and out of the city, which is phenomenal. Speaking of phenomenal, our location. We are blessed to have an amazing location, just 15 minutes away from Dubai Marina, 15 minutes away from one of the most important logistical ports in the whole region. 15 minutes away from what's going to be the world's largest airport or just one metro station away, which is great. Let me remind you of His Highness's tweet from April of this year, where he announced and told the whole world about his plans, 128 billion dirham expansion to make the world's largest airport right here in Dubai. We've all been to DXB, beautiful, huge. What's the size of this new airport? Five times the size. And within 10 years, all the operations will be moving to here with a capacity of 260 million. Do you know the footfall that that means to the city? It means to investors, to offices and the likes. That takes extraordinary vision. And the vision of Expo City Dubai is a beautiful one. A city that propels human progress by harnessing the power of we. We are a city that is a clean, innovative, driven city. 100% of all the energy that we utilize only comes from renewable sources. We are the leaders in terms of sustainability. There are three very important things that I love about this project. 
and I'll tell you about that in a second. It's a G plus 16 building. There's three towers, and no matter where you are located in the building, you have the best views. Let's start with right over here, the UA Pavilion. If you haven't seen the UA Pavilion, you have to experience it to see the actual beauty of this lovely architecture. What else? That's not all. So this is the tower one that we are launching. And so you have beautiful views towards the UA Pavilion. The three bedrooms that are facing right here in the front and several of these, you also have beautiful views to all Wasso Dome and Surreal Water Feature. Let me show you a little bit about that. What I love about Surreal Water Feature, you have gorgeous views both during the day and at night, no matter the time of day. Beautiful views all day long. The whole city just lights up. And one of my favorite things about the views of El Wasso Dome is that it's translucent. So no matter where you are in the whole city, you're always gonna see the beautiful colors of it changing and moving. And there's always unique custom shows that happen at El Wasso Dome, which is great. What about to the left side? To the left side, we have the beautiful Terra. And Terra is becoming an even bigger focal point in the new redesign. There's now gonna be a huge plaza all around it. You see these, Escalators that take you from underground parking all the way, these already exist. These already exist. The city is already alive. We're just expanding it. We're just making it better. There are so many amenities in the building from the ground floor up. Just here on the ground floor, you have beautiful boutique coffee shops, gourmet stores, food and beverage. Guys, you never have to leave the city to get absolutely everything you want. And if you decide to take a step outside the city, guess what? You're in Expo City and Buy, where you're just full of amenities. This is a city within a city. And if we go just a few steps up to the beautiful amenities deck, we have the longest list of amenities that will be sure to entertain everyone, even the most pickiest. What about our lobbies? Our lobbies look like this, and then our elevator lobbies, and you go directly to your apartment, so welcome home. Spacious apartments, high ceilings. Your typical ceiling height in Dubai is 2.7 meters. That's not good enough for us. We're doing 3.15 high ceiling heights. Mm -hmm. And when you combine those with floor to ceiling windows, window walls, what happens? You bring a lot more natural light into the apartment and you can take advantage of all those beautiful views that we've already established. And then what? It makes your apartment look bigger, brighter, happier. Right? What's another thing that I love about city residences? All the floor plans have very generous sizes. And let me show them to you. There are 10 apartments per floor only we have four one beds four two beds and two three beds with direct views towards all loss of dome let me introduce you our payment plan starting with just 10 percent for reservation and then 10 percent within 30 days right and then after that just small easy installments of five percent about every four months construction is going to take three years so during construction you're paying 60 percent on handover, you pay 10%, which is Q4 2027. And then after that, the remaining 30%, two years post handover, which is great. None better than sitter residences with one beds over 980 square feet, starting at 1.88 million and four bedrooms all the way up to four bedroom penthouses that are over 4,100 square feet at 8.5 million in a great location which is just three minutes okay so now we know they changed the payment plan but it's still very good for the investors now let's go see the show at the dome i wouldn't expect less from expo let's go This is it for the launch. There will be much more to come, but be on time to grab your unit with still extended payment plan. Yes, you can reach out to me at any time.